So here we are day two. This time we're going to check out the trail that goes next to Agua Pedra Creek. So I'm going to head on up to that junction and go to the right this time. So yesterday we turned left here and went up to Indian Lake. And today we're going straight over to Agua Pedra Creek. We just came to a cattle guard gate. Beautiful trail so far though. This trail seems to be a little bit rockier than we expected and we have not come to the water crossing. It looks like it's a little bit farther. So hopefully that's coming up soon. We found the creek and it looks like there is a bridge. bit of a wobbly bridge, but we made it over okay. Found a beautiful meadow. So what do you think of the trail so far? Nice little rocky in spots, but easy going, slow mellow climb up, nothing difficult. Yeah, this is a, definitely an easy trail. It's a little obscure in places. You have to glance around, look around and try to figure out, stay close to the water. But it's more open than we expected. A lot of meadows. Might be a good backpacking destination. And we're gonna check for sites if we see any. This is a beautiful, easy hike. This would be a great hike for families with small children or people who don't walk really fast, who are looking to get out and enjoy the forest scenery, the wildlife, and just the beauty of northern New Mexico mountains. We highly recommend this as a beginner hike. It would be a great hike to take your dogs on to let your dogs check things out. There is the water with the creek also, which makes it really nice. There are beautiful meadows. We didn't see any deer, but we did see elk sign all over the area too. We only went about a mile and a half out on the trail before we decided to turn back. But it is a really nice hike. I definitely think you should check it out if you're looking for an easy one. The Sounds of Nature. We only saw a few other people out on the trail and they had dogs with them that were enjoying a nice run in the fields. So this is a nice quiet hike too that does not get as much traffic as the Indian Lake hike. Well, we just found morel mushrooms right next to the trail. Holy cow. 
We just found a fire pit probably a mile into the hike. Maybe not even that far from the trailhead. And the creek is over that way. Ron just went to check to see how far it is. And it looks like there was a a fire pit over there but the forest service will break them up if they're too close to the water you have to be 200 feet away from any water source so that one's definitely too close but this one is perfect and you're right off the trail at least 50 feet which is a requirement and a big nice field here for tents So it's not a long hike in, but it's pretty. A good way to get water there. Yep. Cool. So if we found this one, I'm sure there are others farther up the trail. Because this one's definitely far enough from the creek as well as the trail. So if you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more episodes. We have lots of camping and hiking adventures coming up this summer and maybe a little backpacking too. So as I always say, get out there and hug a tree. Thanks for watching.